Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. My name is Paige and today I'm going to be sharing with you my nighttime skincare routine for the fall. So jumping right on in, on this night in particular, I had makeup on and I really like to pre-cleanse before I cleanse if I have makeup on. And this night in particular, I think I like double pre-cleanse, but I'll go in first with a baby wipe. I prefer baby wipes over makeup wipes. They're cheaper and they're just more gentle on my skin. So I just like to use that on the bulk of my face to get all of my like foundation-y type makeup off and then using this micellar water I will use that same makeup wipe because we're trying to be cost effective over here so I'll just go in and take off most of my eye makeup this does a really good job and it gets off quite a bit of it but like I said I am going to go in and cleanse my face even more now to pre-cleanse you can definitely just go straight in with this oil right here I love this stuff it's like it just melts all the impurities and the makeup off your face but just to make my life a little easier I do like to go in and pre pre cleanse when I have a lot of eye makeup on but you can definitely just go in with this step before you do your majority of your cleansing to your skin this stuff is awesome I will have everything neatly organized and linked down below so that you can find any of these products I love and swear by these I have seen such a huge difference in my skin and I know that it's from these amazing products so if I have makeup on I'll go in with a dark colored washcloth just so that I'm not ruining our white washcloths with dark makeup so I'll just use one that's a darker shade and go in and make sure that I'm cleansing that oil off my face before I go in with my cleanser I have been so obsessed with these little stick cleansers here lately. They're very easy to travel with and they're just really convenient. And this one does a super duper good job. So I love exfoliating my face, but I don't want to stress my skin out and do a whole lot of tugging and over exfoliate. Some of the things that I've used in the past, I definitely think maybe have harmed my skin because it was just a little too harsh. But this combination right here is amazing. This little miraculous little magical sponge here helps exfoliate my skin without um, really tugging at it and really using any kind of harsh little beads like the little sand like granules that you have in some exfoliators this one definitely helps it's super gentle on your face but it goes in to all of those nasty pores and cleans everything out What's really cool about this little sponge is that it doesn't harbor bacteria so you don't have to worry about any nastiness getting on it once you rinse it out you just hang it up and let it dry and you can use it multiple times before you have to get a new one now to pat my face dry and I'm going to use a different towel this is just how I get down this is what I do and you definitely want to be super gentle I know on some of the clips it looked like I was pulling at my face but I'm really not I try to be super gentle as I possibly can be <laughs> now I'm just going to go in with some rose water spray and just mist that all over while that's drying I'm going to apply the thing I get most questions about and this is my favorite treatment that I like putting on my lips it's just vitamin E oil I'll have it linked down below for this specific one I love the packaging on this it makes it super easy to apply this kind combination right here is everything life changing if you get nothing else get this stuff right here you only need a couple drops so of this depending on what my skin will need I'll do about three drops of the lotion if I think my skin needs a little bit more and this rose hip oil just two drops it goes so far and I like to press it into my skin it is incredible I cannot speak any highly of that combination than what I already have. And my tried and true spot treatment to finish my face off if I have any breakouts or anything that looks like it might be a breakout the next day, I cover it. I cover it all. This stuff is amazing. I sleep in it. This is probably like at this point, maybe my 10th bottle of this stuff. 
I absolutely love it. I never run out. I always make sure I get another one before that bottle is empty. And I kind of get a little out of hand with it sometimes. I have so many dots on my face by the time I'm finished. But you just sleep in it and in the morning you wake up to super beautiful clear skin. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure to leave me a comment down below of your favorite tried and true skincare products. And I'll see you on the next one guys. Have a beautiful and blessed day. Bye.